India has taken a major step forward in its push to develop a next-generation stealth fighter jet. Seven Indian defence companies, private companies, have officially placed bids to work with the DRDO or Defence Research and Development Organisation on building the Advanced Medium Combat Aircraft or AMCA, the country's first fifth-generation stealth fighter. A high-level committee headed by former BrahMos Aerospace Chief Dr. A. Sivathano Pillai is now reviewing the proposals. From these, two firms will be chosen to develop five prototype aircraft. A budget of 15,000 crore rupees will be split between them for this phase of the project. Big names in the defence sector are among the bidders, including Larson & Tubro, LNT, Hall, HAL, Tata Advanced System Limited, and Adani Defence. Once selected, the chosen companies will work alongside DRDO to create aircraft built to the highest standards of stealth, speed and combat capability. The AMCA is a part of a wider 2 lakh crore rupee program, which aims to produce over 125 fighter jets for the Indian Air Force in the coming years. However, the first operational aircraft is not expected before 2035. If successful, India will become the fourth country in the world to operate a fifth-generation fighter, joining the United States, Russia and China. The AMCA is designed to be a twin-engine, single-seat fighter built for multiple combat roles. It will feature stealth design, internal weapons base and high-tech sensors. Plans suggest it will fly as high as altitudes of 55,000 feet and carry weapons both inside and under the wings, with a total payload of over 7,000 kilograms. Two versions are expected. The first may use an imported engine, but the second is planned to run on an indigenous power plant currently under development. This project is a part of India's wider effort to modernize its military and reduce dependence on imports. Earlier this year, the country signed a 63,000 crore rupee deal for Rafale marine jets from France. It's also investing in new warships, submarines and missile systems. Defence Minister Rajnath Singh has promised $100 billion worth of contracts for homegrown military equipment by 2033 and AMCA is said to be one of the flagship projects in the plan.